much. So this is a way to bait deer in, even if you've got a terrible acorn problem. Now, what I want to tell you is that this is a new product, and I'm still learning about it, but it is some kind of incredible. The, uh, you'll notice that I've got two buckets right here with some corn in it, okay? What I'm going to do is take some of this hysteria right here. This is a dry product like this, okay? So I'm just going to put a little bit in the corn. And then I've got two buckets because what I want to do is I want to kind of use the buckets to mix it up. It does not take much hysteria at all, but I'm going to mix it up that way that real fine product will get mixed in with all the corn, just like that. And it is a way to, if you want to put the deer right here, this is the way to do it. I'm going to do a pile of stuff right here. And just to top it off, we're going to put a little bit more hysteria on it. I'm going to turn my Reconnex camera on right there and then we'll monitor it and see what happens. I got a hunter that's coming in a few days and we're hoping to bait some deer in this spot. Look at this deer. Man, look at him. Good Lord. He is monstrous. Golly. Since we've been out here, we've been seeing deer. There's a bunch of deer in the field. You know, this, this guy came off this hill here behind us, and I knew right then that I wanted this deer. He was monstrous, stuck out. Came in, probably 20 other deer out there with him, never could get a shot. Finally, he went behind some trees, stepped out broadside, didn't run more than 50 yards. These antlers here, golly, look at them. But that's five inches around right there. Just massive, straight massive. Probably 26, 27 inches wide. Good length, good length on them. I bet we had seven or eight Really, really nice young deer. Another couple years, they're gonna be some monsters. Phenomenal, straight phenomenal here. It is amazing. So I'm super excited about uh, finding a product that's gonna attract deer, especially when you've got tens of thousands of oak trees on a piece of property with millions upon millions of acorns falling. I mean, we have used hysteria the entire season so far and the acorns have been a real challenge to our neighbors, but for us, we're able to put deer in the exact same spot where we're hunting, and that's a, a pretty cool deal. And we do it effectively. Now, regardless of whatever bait you use, make sure before 
you start baiting to find out if it's legal in your area. While you're at it, make sure and subscribe to our channel and share this with a friend.